this taste bud tantalizing episode of Devil Gourmet, the devil is heading to the Long Valley Pub and Brewery located in Long Valley, New Jersey. A place where there's always a seat, a fresh home brew, and a great meal waiting. The brew pub takes great pride in its homemade beer. The devil talked with head brewer Joe Saya to find out a little bit more about what goes into making their award-winning beers. We've been pretty successful. We generally get into two competitions, the World Beer Cup, in the Great American Beer Festival. Both, both are considered to be the most prestigious beer competitions in the world. Uh, most recently, our Lazy Jack Porter won a silver medal out at the Great American Beer Festival. Altogether, since 1999, we've won seven medals out there, which is, is quite an accomplishment for our little Seven Bow Brewery. We're, we're pretty proud of it. So we typically run four standard beers. We always have something that somebody's looking for, whether it's a light beer, dark beer, a heavy beer, a light beer. Um, but we also do two seasonal brews. Um, and that's where I get to be a little creative. The four standards, when people come in, they're looking for those beers. They want them to be the same every time. It gives you the opportunity to pair a beer up with your dinner and, and with your appetizer and even with your dessert sometimes. Beer's a lot like wine, with the exception that um, people are finding that beer is more diverse. There's more different flavors. There's more for your palate to, to absorb and, and, and really take in with your food. A guy coming in for a cheeseburger, french fries, he's look, always looking at that German Valley Amber. For some reason, they just pair up amazingly well. Anything blackened, anything with a lot of pepper, things like that, people are going for that Lazy Jake Porter. From the time I brew a beer and filter it, and it hits the bar, it's rarely over two weeks old. Beer is, is, is a fresh product. If beer isn't fresh, it's just no good. Fresh beer is, is the only way to drink beer. The devil grabbed a pint of the Lazy Jake Porter and went in search of owner Steve Bissell to get a little bit of history about the brew pub. Landmark restaurant is the Long Valley Brew Pub. History going back to, I believe, 1771. Originally, the building started as a bank barn. Um, they housed cattle in here. So it, as the name implies, the front of the building was built on a bank of earth, so you could come in the front door, which was now on the second level. And in the back, you could get underneath the barn, and that's where they would store their equipment. Each building is a historic landmark in the area. Each building, it's got its own history. The building closed and was closed down. This was for, for many, many years, and it was in, in such a state of disrepair that it would have either had to be renovated or demolished. And it, and it just seems such a shame to demolish this beautiful building here. And around 1995, a group of investors bought it. They renovated the building, renovated the property, and made it into uh, what it is today, a restaurant, brew pub, with home-brewed beer and great burgers and entrees. It, it leads us into that novelty that we are, the beautiful building, the beautiful area, and the unique beers that you can only get here. With another fresh beer in its claws, the devil was off to meet executive chef Juan Mujica. Passion is cooking, uh, I love to cooking. We have like seafood every day, we have vegetable every day, dessert, we, we get fresh every day. Almost ready. This is on the menu, roasted chicken, crispy potato, sauté spinach. The devil watched this delightful dish come together right before his very eyes. But that was not all. Chef Juan launched right into another dish, this time a fresh salmon served with couscous, veggies, and mango salsa. Oh, French green bean, the salmon, a little salt pepper, salmon, fresh mango salsa. From the salmon, Chef displayed his eye-catching southwestern salad. Uh, it was southwestern, a little spicy, they had a chipotle ranch, barbecue chicken, and we made the fresh salsa with fresh avocado. Not to mention a sumptuous looking ribeye, known as the cowboy steak. This cut comes complete with fluffy mashed potatoes, seasonal vegetables, and then topped with frizzed onions for some crunchy goodness. If that wasn't enough, Chef personally showed the devil the famous 8 ounce brew pub burger. Ground beef burger, we make the own burgers. Um, eight ounce burger, uh, it's fresh. We do um, prep every day. Okay, let's start cooking burger. You know, a lot of salt, pepper, and burger. Okay, people order burger, right? Absolutely, that's handcuffed and fried. It's fresh. Now, this is a burger. Chef Juan doesn't just cook, he creates unbelievable landscapes of food, rich in color and texture. These are delights that beg to be paired with one of the brewery's tasty beers. Chef Juan enjoys his work and it shows. He explains why he and his team are able to work their magic. Teamwork, you know, I, my sister chef, uh, Akuna, my leader is uh, Manuel Cabrera. 
you know, it's just uh, always a thank you to my guy. You know, they do, everybody do a great job. I'm very happy. This is like, this is like all my team kitchen. You can enjoy this great menu both inside the pub and outdoors, thanks to its spacious patio area, perfect for a sunny New Jersey afternoon. We have a outside bar that seats about 35 people. The entire patio seats about 100 people. Sundays we have uh, live music. It's become a really, really popular place to hang out. And they enjoy coming out, whether it's once a week or once a year, to enjoy a product that they can only get one place in the world, which is right here at the Long Valley Pub and Brewery. I've done this before. <laughs> That's all for this episode of Devil Gourmet. Thanks to Steve, Joe, Chef Juan, and the whole crew at the Long Valley Pub and Brewery. We invite you to search, connect, and indulge with the devil at devilgourmet.com. And be sure to find us on Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus for the latest updates, special deals, and all things devil.